Leonardo DiCaprio will reteam with his Django Unchained director Quentin Tarantino for his Pulp Fiction-esque ninth feature centered around the Charles Manson murders in Hollywood back in 1969. According to Deadline, the 43-year-old Oscar winner nabbed one of the two meaty male roles circled by Tom Cruise and Brad Pitt, which was referred to only as an aging actor. Coincidentally, the 54-year-old filmmaker is also after The Wolf of Wall Street's former leading lady Margot Robbie to play murder victim Sharon Tate in the Sony flick slated for release in 2019. Scroll down for video The Manson family mastermind died November 19, age 83, while serving his life sentence for for seven counts of first-degree murder and one count of conspiracy to commit murder at the California State Prison in Corcoran. Because he's got his own unique, specific style, and when you see a Quentin Tarantino movie, you know it. The last time Leonardo and a two-time Oscar winner collaborated was in 2012 on Tarantino's critically acclaimed Western, which amassed $425.4 million at the worldwide box office. The Titanic alum relished his role as the charming but cruel candle and plantation owner Monsieur Calvin J. Candy, who forced his slaves to fight to the death in Manango wrestling matches. Meanwhile, the habitual mod Elizer's latest flavor of the month Camilla Moroni shared a truly silly video of herself deliriously sick after their holiday together skiing in Aspen. The 20-year-old IMG model thought it was the funniest thing ever to show off her naked back and do pelvic thrusts in a hospital room.